Hi everyone, welcome. My name is Andreas Watts, and in this tutorial, we're gonna learn about this. Okay, everyone, so in this uh, Shopify tutorial, we're gonna learn how we can add a countdown timer on your Shopify store using the Ultimate Sales Boost in 2019. So, to do this, just go to your back end. Okay, so to add a countdown timer on your Shopify store, just go to your back end and go to apps, click on that. Go to visit the Shopify App Store, click on that. Alright, so now we're gonna search for Countdown Timer. And I'm gonna click on this one, free. All right, so now we're gonna choose this one, Ultimate Sales Boost, click on that. All right, so increase sales with uh, scarcity, urgency, trust, and countdown timer. All right. So this one has a rating of uh, 4.8 based on 4,078 reviews. All right, so you can read about the reviews right here. So in this tutorial with the uh, ultimate sales boost, we're gonna use the free plan. All right, so let's go and install this application. Click on add app. Click on install app. Okay, so here we have the campaign list. We're gonna click on add new campaign. And we're gonna choose this one, flash sale. Create time-based urgency with the countdown timers throughout collections, product, and cart page. Okay, so I'm gonna click on select template. Now we got campaign name. You can name this to whatever you like. So this is for your own internal reference. Only you can see it, okay? Okay, so first we got this home collection page. So make products stand out on home page and collection page. So to use this, you need to upgrade. So we're gonna uncheck this one. Then we go down to product page config. So motivate customers to add to cart on product page. We see the preview right here. So we're gonna go down to this one, countdown timer, okay? So first we see message above the timer, so this one. So we can change this if you want to whatever we like. And then we have countdown from fixed minutes, so this one. Now we have 60 minutes, so 60 minutes right here. So we can move it right here to increase the minutes. And now we got 11 hours and 46 minutes. And we can also change it right here. So let's say we want to have 60 minutes like that. So now we got 60 minutes right here. Okay. Then we got when the timer reaches zero hours and zero minutes, you can choose to restart the countdown or hide the countdown. Okay. We can change the top background color right here. We can change the bottom background color. You can also add a color code and we can change the digit text color. Okay. We got message font size. We can increase the message font size like that. We can also change the timer font size like that. Okay. When you're satisfied, just go down to aligns too. So you can align to left, center, or right. I'm gonna choose 
align center like that and let's go down you also got this checkout booster so this one check out within minutes so we don't run out of stock so we can choose a select type cart timer we can change the message before the timer so this one and this one and message after the timer this one so you see it right here so we don't run out of stock same thing here we can change the minutes countdown from fixed minutes like that we can also change it right here like that and we got when the timer reaches zero hours and zero minutes display a message so this message or restart countdown or hide the countdown okay so you can change this message if you like we can change the shape to uh, round like that or square so i'm going to choose square the same thing here we can change the left background color we can change the right background color and text color okay and we can change the message font size like that okay so when you're satisfied just go down so here we got uh, targeting we can choose applies to products all products or target products based on manual selection so we can have maximum 100 products per campaign and you see 100 products left so to add products just click on browse products and just choose all the products you want to have this uh, countdown timer on so let's say I want to have on this this and this click on select products like that and now you also see 97 products left and you see the products list right here you can click on edit to remove products like that click on done when you're done so in my case I'm gonna choose all products and we also have applies to countries all countries or target selected countries with upgrade applies to customers all customers or upgrade to have target customers based on customers tag or lifetime spent okay we got active dates always display or schedule display with upgrade so when you're satisfied just click on save boost created successfully and now we got this uh, active my flash sales boost we got targeting all products all countries all customers always display if you want to change something we can click on edit we can also duplicate this uh, countdown timer and we can also pause this campaign and after that you can delete it right here but in this case we're gonna activate it like that so let's go to a product and have a look let's click on products click on a product click on view and now we see the countdown timer right here so we see sales ends in 60 minutes and if I add to cart and we also got this one check out within 45 minutes so we don't run out of stock Okay everyone, so this is how you can add a countdown timer on your Shopify store in 2019. I hope this helped. Okay everyone, so this is the end of this tutorial. I hope this helped. If you want, you can leave a comment below. You can subscribe to my channel right here.
and also check out my latest video right here. So I hope you have an awesome day, take care and bye.